So I've just finished recording my video on merging in Power Query versus XLOOKUP versus Power Pivot in the data model. And there's a challenge. If, if you have duplicates in your lookup table, or table you're merging on the side, it can double up your data. So let me show you. So my screen looks like this. I've got my items and my lookup values, and I'm doing a merge in Power Query to spit out this table with name and cost, which is basically looked up from this table and tagged onto the side of this table. All good, okay? However, if I add on another A, okay, with anything in here, this could be Apple or it could be, you know, Aardvark or whatever for 10, normally what would happen, as I showed in my last video, is when you right click and refresh this, you get double ups of all the A's. Now I want to warn the end user. So check this out. This is the challenge that you have to get working. Right click, refresh. It tells you duplicate lookup values and there's the A, okay? If I put a C in there, okay? And right click, because there's two C's now and say right click, refresh. There's now A and C. If I put a D in there and right click, refresh. Okay, but if I put an F in here twice, there is no F in my data, so I don't want the warning. So right click, refresh, no warning about the F. Okay, and if I get rid of C, D, okay, if I get rid of those, all right, sorry, an A, don't need A anymore. Okay, right click, refresh, everything just works. Okay, even if there's a double a double up of F, okay, because F is not in my data. Right click, refresh. This works, but as soon as I put a double up that exists, like if I put F in here now, okay, and put 20, uh, click in there, 20, and now I refresh it because there's double F, I get a warning and it tells me there's duplicates. All right, this is a tricky little one, okay, have a go. I'll do my little solution at the end of September. Power Query Challenge, go for it.